Hello everyone, Melissa and Anthea here with more tips for you. And today we're talking about the power of going within and reconnecting within your very being. Mind, body, and spirit are meant to be connected in harmony. When there's disconnect within, there can be disharmony within your being as well as your life experiences. So the power of reconnecting within is connecting within to your very being. And when you exist from a state of love and gratitude, it feels so good, doesn't it, Anthea? Absolutely, it does. It's um, when you when you feel when you're when you're uh, when you're feeling that love in within you, it does radiate out outside of you. It's yeah. like everything starts from within. Mm. People spend a lot of time searching outside so to true. find what's actually inside it's the constant thing of um I'll be happy when or um I'm searching for you know I'm searching for my partner to be good for me or I want them to be they want them to be the catalyst to help me feel good well mm. actually it comes down to us like actually yeah. everything is about you as in me about you and you know there's we everyone follows like different religions or or the universe or people that say the divine god whatever you want to call it and absolutely there's a belief for wherever you want to go there but the, everything comes back down to you again mm -hmm. everything comes from within nothing's from outside so if you feel that something is missing it's not a matter of searching outside of yourself to find the missing piece it's a matter mm -hmm. of going inside of yourself finding that within you and filling yourself up with that so if you feel like love is missing fill yourself with love if you feel like there's a lack of appreciation in your life fill yourself with appreciation for life yeah. if you feel that there is um lack of uh, let's say money then fill yourself within and feel what it feels like to have the money mm. doesn't matter what it is um everything comes from within right melissa absolutely and when you love and bless all that is good that feels so good doesn't it yeah and it's also the portal to welcome in all the good that you desire because when you're feeling good you're on the frequency of all the good that you desire and reconnecting within and opening up to allow the flow of love and good and gratitude and feeling good the immediate um the immediate benefit is that you feel so good but it's also the way to open up to allow the flow of more good to you for example, when you open up to love and feeling the abundance of love that already exists within you, you can open up to allow the flow of love to you and through you, radiating out from you to our world. What a beautiful state to exist from and a beautiful way to experience life. So Absolutely. we have some great tips on how to connect within because coming home to yourself and feeling your wholeness feels so good, right? Yes, 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 absolutely, Melissa. And I think the first point of call is from the time you wake up in the morning. Um, and, you know, we've both had experiences and many of you probably all had experiences or maybe even experiencing right now where you feel like everything's against you, mm. everything, nothing may be working out for you, but actually, um you can change that because that's all the outer things that we were saying so you start yeah. your morning and rather than waking up and thinking because we're programmed to remember what happened yesterday we're programmed mm -hmm. in a in a very negative place so when you wake up it's no matter of awareness to i just hear yourself what is being said to yourself and actually be really aware of what is being said and be able to stop and say no nah, I'm not I'm not having that today those mm. are just thoughts and I'm not my thoughts yeah like, I am a spiritual being having a human yes. experience yes. and my thoughts are separate to me so you can catch them and they don't control you you control mm. them yes to start from the morning right to mm. say okay what is that what's being said to me and flip that to say actually 
I've just had a really good sleep. I'm really thankful for the bed that I slept in. I really mm. appreciate the pillow underneath my neck that held mm. my head. And I've had, a, and you know, you could actually hold your pillow and say, thank you. Mm. The fact that there's a, you know, you're in a room and you, you are, you can get up and use the bathroom. You're going to brush your teeth. You're going to run in water. Um, all of these things start you in your day in a different vibrational level. Yeah. And it's a feeling of what we were just saying, filling yourself from within mm. with that feeling of appreciation, that feeling of thankfulness. Um, so, yeah, um, that's tip number one. Wake up and just be very thankful and be aware of your thoughts. I know that's two together, yeah. um, but I think they go hand in hand very well. So over to you, Melissa. Yeah, what a beautiful way to start the day, feeling gratitude, feeling the energy of love and appreciation for breath in your body, the pillow, the cozy bed, it feels so good, right? Yeah. And intending your day, you know, deciding, you know, to start your day intentionally in that way and intend the rest of your day, intend your life even, you know, we create our reality, right? So Absolutely. Really? Yeah, how we're feeling within, how we're connecting within and to the divine source, you know, it, it shows up in how we show up in our day. When you are connected within, you can show up empowered in your day and own your energy, your thoughts, and your thoughts create your feelings, and your thoughts and feelings together create how you're showing up in your day. So when you're embodying the person you desire to be now, in your now reality, showing up from that place of love and feeling good and intentionally creating your day. You can start with meditation. That's one powerful practice. I personally love guided meditations and affirmations to start my day, going out in nature with my cup of coffee on the back deck and just feeling the abundance of nature and the beauty of nature, another beautiful way to start your day and to connect within, to just spend some time with you and your inner being. And for our third tip, Anthea. Um, I think we were just, I was going to say meditation. And yeah. I think what we've done is, uh, yeah, meditation in what you was just saying mm. uh, was to actually when we say meditation, it doesn't need to be that you sit and, and yeah. I'm just going to expand on it really. It doesn't mean that yeah. you have to sit in, in one place and just sit and be there. Just mm -hmm. going outside and meditating on, on, your, on what's going on around, as in the nature, the sun coming up, the, the, the air that you breathe, um, just the way you think about things, that is meditating in, in, within yourself. So yeah. Yes, you have a form of meditation where you sit down mm -hmm. and you can quiet your mind. Then you've got a form of meditation where you are actually affirming your day ahead of you and mm -hmm. being thankful for, for things before they have, before you've lived them. Mm -hmm. Because no matter what, um, our, our thoughts create our reality. So mm -hmm. if we're sitting there and we're starting our day and thinking of what could you know, thinking of what could come to us, what greatness can come our way today. And you're mm. asking the question, you know, what can you bring to me today to, to, to help me feel that power within me, to help me make a difference to myself, mm. to other people? Um, and I think that is, you know, a really powerful way to start your yeah. day. And it only takes, it sounds like it could take a long time, but actually... Um, I could say tip three, just wake up 20 minutes earlier than what you normally would wake up mm. um, and just take this time for yourself because there is nothing more important than you, yeah. you filling yourself up and being ready for your day. Um, and like Melissa said, showing up, showing up in the best way you can show up. Someone, if someone bugs you, somebody gets to you, mm. just, you know, realize that there's something in you because everything is a reflection. There's mm. nothing outside of us. Everything is with inside, within us. Yeah. Everything is within us. So be very aware. So of absolutely like meditating, intentions, um, self-love, 
mm, uh, affirmations. Yeah. I mean, it's more than what we said, the three tips, but yeah. look, all of it is, you know, yeah. it's all relevant. So it all kind of bundles together, right? Mm. And um, we just want you to have the best, best life you could possibly live. And yeah. all of that starts from within. So that is what this is all about today. It's stop searching outside of yourself yeah. and start looking within and live the best that you can live for you. Mm. And uh, so on that note, Melissa. Yeah, beautiful yeah. message. That was yeah. beautiful. Much Have love, everyone. Much Thanks love, everybody. Joining. See you later. Take care.